All right, so we're gonna go ahead and get started on the floor. The first move is gonna be flutter kicks. So pull your stomach in, stretch your legs out six inches, and you can flutter. For this one, you can also go on your forearms and flutter. Let's point our toes. If you're laying down and doing it, let's bring our head up. This way we engage our upper abs at the same time and you're fluttering. And we're doing 30 seconds each move with a quick 10 second rest in between. And we're gonna repeat for three times. There's about five moves. Stomach tight, try to pull it in and relax for a quick 10 seconds. Let's roll on over. All right, so for this one, you're gonna do forearm planks. So you're gonna get up on your forearms, pull that stomach in, and then you're gonna alternate, lift your leg. If you can't lift your leg, just focus on holding it there. Stomach nice and tight. And it's not about going fast. It's about trying to keep your core engaged while you're lifting your legs. And it burns already. And relax. All right, stay right here. We're gonna go all the way up into high plank. Remember, you're pulling your stomach in. Wrist in line with your shoulders. Come on up. Bring your tushy down out of the ear and squeeze it. So if you guys have been doing 100 push-ups a day with me, your arms are really feeling it. Ooh. 10 more seconds. Ooh. And relax. All right, so we're still here in the plank position. All right, this time for, if you're a newbie, you could do forearm plank. And all you're gonna do is just touch and then come back, touch. If you can go up a high plank, touch. If you can reach all the way to your toes, go ahead and try to reach to the toes. If you can only get to your knee, That's fine. And relax. All right, here we go, roll on over. Give those arms a break. So you're gonna have one leg up in the air, the other one down, and you're gonna alternate. And remember, you can put your hands underneath. If you like, pull the stomach in. Almost there. And relax. We got a 30 second break. And my abs is killing me. I don't know if it's those push ups, but I am feeling it. So if you're doing 100 push ups a day with me, you can definitely feel the burn in your shoulders, especially in my shoulders. All right, so we're gonna start all over from the beginning, right? Not too bad, easy, no sweat, right? Five more seconds, here we go, we're gonna set it up for flutter kicks, and go. And remember, you can put your hand underneath your booty, pull your core nice and tight, or you can sit on up, whichever you like, because it hurts either way. Whew. 10 more seconds.
I'm feeling it. Like my entire core section is like on fire. Here we go, roll over, flutter kicks. That quick 30 seconds is up. We gotta roll over, right? Forearm plank with the alternating leg lifts. Remember, you're trying to keep the core tight. We're gonna hold it. I'm sweating from abs. Do you see it dripping off my forehead? <laughs> All right, come on up. So you can hold high plank. If this one is too challenging for you guys, remember you could go down to forearm plank. Five more seconds. And relax. Whew. It's like having a baby and I feel like my abs are not mine. They're so weak right now. So here we go. High plank. Touch. Take your time. Take your time. myself. <laughs> Stomach tight. <clears throat> Breathe. <clears throat> and relax. Here we go. Roll over. Last one. Best one. We got this. We made it. Leg lifts. <sighs> Alternate. We can do it. Push it. Woo! In time. We're done. I want to say get up, but don't you have to use your abs for that? Woo! Hey guys, and before you go, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Give this video a thumbs up. Follow me on Instagram if you're not doing so, or on my Facebook. See you next time.